In today's project, we're going to create an AI chatbot. And this will be an introduction to AI. In the previous project, we used some AI, but in this one, we'll be creating a more elaborate AI engine. Let's go ahead and get started. So first, we're going to go ahead and get the flag. Then we're getting a forever loop. find the ask where's that ask so we need to ask the user to say something here it is say or ask something then we're using an if. Oh, using an if and else. So before we get further, we need to create a list. Let's uh, go ahead and do that. So we're going to go to variables, create a list. We're going to name our list. So we're going to make it, call it make a list. Make a list put ok on that apologies you need to rename this to <laughs> prompts so this is what we're going to be keeping a list of uh, stuff our AI learns now we're gonna go check for the prompt mm, we're trying to find prompts there we go prompts contains things so we're gonna check if the if the prompt list contains uh, the answer to the ask block. So let's do that. Let's see if it contains the answer. You put answer here. If it contains answer, then we're going to create a broadcast. So the broadcast again is just a uh, call to a function and we're going to create our brass cost call response respond respond okay so it looks like they want us to use the brass cast and wait and we wanted to Cause respond and wait. Then we have a then we need to use a broadcast and learn. I lost my mouse. So we wanted to, when it's prompted to answer, it'll go through its response. If it's not prompted, then it's going to be learning. Okay, so now we're going to write the uh, function to teach the AI to learn. So let's do that. So let's start by when. When we receive a learn, I'm going to add add thing to prompts. From here. 
So from the variables tab, bring out and add things to prompt block. The block adds anything in the text field to the prompts list. Okay. So when and add answer to prompt. So whatever we answer to it wants us to add it to the prompt. Now how do we is we're gonna teach you how to answer to the new prompt. What should I say next time? Oh, okay. So they want us to add a uh, sorry. I do not know how. To respond to that yet. And to me, this is kind of like what um, Alexa does or, or Google. They would you ask them questions and they don't know what to tell you, so they'd say, Sorry, I don't have an answer to that. Or, so I think this is a similar idea. So now we're creating a new list to make another list, and we're gonna call these response responses. And we're gonna bring out another add thing to prompt. We're gonna add answer to it. And we're going to do the response. And we're putting a say block. Ooh, where's the say block? There it is. Say answer. for two seconds okay let's test this say or ask something hello sorry I do not know how to respond to that yet what will I what should I say next hello oh huh. okay Say or ask something. Hello. So we haven't coded the system to respond back to us on the answer yet, but it knows how to put something in the list when we teach it. So we're basically teaching it. So we're asked saying, um, what day is today? doesn't know what day is today so then it's asking us what to say Sunday and he knows what to say so we're basically teaching it how to respond to different questions okay so now we're gonna code the uh, the uh, to teach the AI to recognize when you know something Let's see. So we taught it how to learn. Now we're going to teach it how to respond. When I receive respond, you wanted to set. Mm. Set a 
response to hmm, no, think about the wrong one. Okay. No, it's just to use this one. It's my variable. It is response. A response and we're gonna do item of things item number of answer in prompts now we wanted to find the correct answer so let's teach you how to do that Okay. You wanted to say hello. Well, oh, this is just set up, but I wanted to respond back. Number item of responses. So we're gonna do responses here. Response, response. Okay, so let's see. Let's look at these. It's a quick recap. This is a main loop. And we are asking our AI to ask us to say something or ask something. And it checks to see if, if it's something the user has already said. And if it's in the list. And if not, then it learns it. It's going to check if we have already dotted that or if it needs to learn it. Then over here, right here, we're teaching the AI so that it adds things to the list and to the response. So it asks us, and then we it asks us what it what do you get, what do we want it to say when we ask them that kind of stuff. And so then it'll add it to our our make a list and to our response. So. They will add the, what we say it to say right here to a response. So the next time it will know what to say. Then on the final one here, the response function, it, we're teaching it how to answer. It will check to see if it's something we have already dotted. And then it will let us know and tell us back. So let's try that. Okay. What is your name? So it doesn't know what its name is. Well, we're gonna call it Judy. Okay, now let's see. What day is today? Sunday. So now it knows how to respond back to us. And let's see. Hello. It says hello. So remember, the computer only responds back resp depending on how you code it. So, hey is not the same thing as hello, so it doesn't know how to say hey back or hello. So we're teaching it how to do that. Or if you say, um, Like hello, 
with exclamation, it will know what that means. You need to teach it the hello with exclamation means hello. So the next time you write hello with exclamation, it's hello. And also, I believe the gram the capitalization might matter too. Oh, it doesn't. Okay, so it doesn't matter. Your lowercase or uppercase. So that is a quick tutorial on AI chatbot. I hope you guys liked it. And um, according to what I was reading, if you put it online and people start using it, it will te you can teach it and it'll keep it'll keep it safe and then eventually be able to learn. And that's how usually uh, different AI bots out there work. Kind of like Alexa and Google and Siri. They would all be learning by what people tell them. And then whatever was pre-programmed on them. But then they start getting all the phrases. That they start getting used to it. But uh, I hope you guys like this. And I'll see you guys next time.